All right, the Williams Strength GHD in reverse hyper combo unit. First thing we'll talk about is the foot adjustment. At the back bottom portion of this machine, there is a foot lever, and you can see me depressing it with my right foot. That allows it to move forward if you're shorter or back if you are taller. Make sure you have a firm grip on the handles as you move it forward. It is very solid, so it is heavy. Once you have it adjusted to where you think you want, you can also drop the foot attachment down or raise it up depending on comfort level. There is a screw portion in the front. You just loosen that and then in the back there, I'm pulling a pin back and that allows it to slide down and up. Once you find your height, you will tighten that screw knob in the front. I kind of put my foot up here to say, oh, this needs to be adjusted before I climb up in the machine and hook all in. This gives me a pretty good idea of where I think I need to be. And then I'll make uh, minor adjustments based on that. The biggest thing is you want something comfortable that your knees feel supported when you go down into the hamstring curl. I think I decided I want to come back one click. Get your feet in solid. And you just don't want your knees to fall down through. So right there is the most comfortable for myself. And that's how you do the hamstring curls. The next portion of this machine is the reverse hyper. You have your pendulum down there with some safety clips. We don't keep these pins in it anymore, but the machine does come with them. We just use the axle bar uh, HG clips, which are those orange uh, clips that you see right there. But if you wanted to use the clips, that's how you use them. They also have this middle attachment portion that you can put your ankle strap to and then move it vertically. I think there's five different spots, maybe four spots that you can clip into. Again, that's all comfort, so you can mess around with this and whatever feels the best for you, pick that spot. This machine also has adjustable arm supports that come out of the front. You can pull this pin, take the whole arm out, rotate it a quarter um, turn, and that'll have the handles sticking out. Do another quarter, the handles will stick down. Another quarter, they'll stick in. And then another quarter, and they'll stick up. You can kind of see the orientation of the handles right there. Again, comfort level and what you're going to use the machine for. So once you have all that adjusted, you will step into the strap, prop yourself up onto the pad. Hip crease in the angle of that pad seems to be the most comfortable. There are hand grips on the outside of the foot pads that you can grab, or you can grab the center post. My face is really close to this pad, so I hop off of it and move that foot pad back a little bit so I don't feel like I have a chunk of steel right in my face. Same thing, put your feet back into the strap. I step up, I have little side steps there to help you get up, and then right back into the movement. Again, using the outside handles, or you can grab that center post. And that is the William Strength Combo Unit. Thank you.